In this video, we'll show you how to calibrate your FD1 drone. It is very important to calibrate your FD1 drone before your first flight, every time you change location or you're flying on the same location on a different day. There are three different types of calibrations, IMU, gyroscope and compass calibration. Let's start with the IMU calibration. For that, you need to power on the controller first and then the drone. Before you power on the controller, make sure all the switches are facing up and allow a few seconds for the drone and controller to pair with each other. Once the controller is paired with your drone, you're now ready to do the IMU calibration. To begin, press and hold the left joystick all the way up and press the right joystick left and right in rapid succession until you see initialization prompt on the controller screen. Wait until that notice disappears and then restart your drone and then the controller. And the reason why you restart your drone and the controller is to save the settings. Once you're done with the IMU calibration, step two is the gyroscope calibration. To begin the gyroscope calibration, again, power on your controller first, making sure all the buttons are facing up and then power on the drone. Allow time for the drone to pair with the controller once paired, you're now ready to do your gyroscope calibration. To begin, press and hold the left joystick all the way down and the right joystick flick it left and right in rapid succession. Wait to see the initialization prompt appear on the controller screen and let go of the buttons. Wait until that notice disappears and now you're ready to restart your drone and then the controller again you restart your drone in the controller to save those settings. Once you're through the gyroscope calibration, you're ready for step three, which is the compass calibration. To begin the compass calibration, power on your controller first, making sure all the buttons are facing up, and then power on the drone, making sure it's on a flat, stable surface. Allow some time for the controller to pair with the drone. Once paired, you're now ready to begin the compass calibration. It is very important to note that you've got 10 satellites on your controller screen before you begin the compass calibration. Now, flick the GPS switch, which is the top right switch, up and down in rapid succession. You'll see the horizontal calibration prompt appear on your controller screen. When that happens, pick up your drone and rotate it in clockwise direction on its axis. Repeat that process two or three times until you see the vertical calibration prompt on your controller screen. Once you see that prompt on the controller screen, tilt your drone with nose facing down, the wide arrows facing down, and continue rotating the drone on its axis in clockwise direction. Eventually, you'll see initializing prompt appear on your controller screen. When that happens, put your drone on the ground exactly how you picked it up. Let the drone initialize and once that prompt disappears, please restart your drone and then the controller. Again, you're restarting them to save the settings. Once all the calibrations are complete, you can put your props on and you're ready for your first flight. 